Hello. So on Thursday night, Friday morning, 12.30, two hoodied and masked men drove a vehicle right up to my gate and set it on fire. They were fully aware of the CCTV that was in place. They took great pains to hide themselves. The car exploded and was rapidly and efficiently dealt with by Hampshire Fire and Rescue and the police were in attendance. And as ever, they did a fantastic job, but not before it had caused extensive damage to my property. This leaves me with some questions. Firstly, who were these two men? Were they members of the RSPB, the Wildlife Trust, Butterfly Conservation, Bat Conservation Trust? Were they members of the Countryside Alliance, the British Association for Shooting and Conservation? Members of the Hunt, perhaps? Or were they some of my internet trolls who fill my timeline with hate? Defamatory comments, libelous comments, but lots of hate calculated to damage myself and my interest. I don't know. I wonder about the internet trolls because they get away with it. Despite working effectively with the police, the law as it stands means that I'm, I'm unable to take any action against this form of harassment. But it is hate crime. There is no ambiguity about that. It's a little unfair that when black footballers receive unwarranted and appalling hate crime, the issue can be dealt with. And that's great, of course, and I would support that fully. But I am surprised that when environmentalists like myself receive similarly hateful torrents of relentless abuse, nothing can be done about it.